So I I was in the middle of doing my teacher training up in Manchester and had decided I really would like to go to the Nearbeck College. So I wrote a letter of application and an enormous number of of the teachers of the college knew who I was because they came and lectured at Whoopshies. We're a small community. So everybody knows everybody else. Um, The principal, uh, Albert Friedlander, knew me very well. So I wrote a letter to him asking if I could come to the college. And I received a letter back, Dear Mr. Acker, my, my maiden name. And I heard nothing more. So I phoned up the secretary of the Leobet College, who was a friend, said we all know each other. I said, what do I do? And she said, well, what you should do is she said, your letter is being passed from desk to desk. No one's actually dealing with it. So he said, what you should do is send another letter in with a copy to Rabbi Hugo Grin, who was at that point the rabbi of the West London Synagogue and very involved in the Leobet College. The the Leobet College at that point sat within the building of the West London Synagogue. His, the the, the uh, administration office of the college was opposite Rabbi Hugo Grin's office. So very close. Um, so I did so, and then they sent for me for interview. Um, I went to interview, and I was faced by an interview panel of about seven men, of course. And they asked me all the sorts of normal things I would expect to be asked. But then one of them said, but as a woman, he said, can you read Hebrew? And I said, of of course, I've been taking services. I've got an exam in Hebrew that I did along the way. Well, we'd like you to prove that to us. So they took out a copy of Mishnah Barachot. And luckily, I'd been studying that with Rabbi Mamo. And so I could open it, read and translate. (laughs) Um, Many years later, I looked up the records in the Leobet College and I discovered a letter from Rabbi Mamo, who'd obviously been asked, who is this person? What's she really like? And he, I remember he'd said something about you'll find it much harder to get rid of her than you've done from previous ap- women applications to the college. Um, because you know, she's, she knows Hebrew, she's taking services, she's part of the community.